we have come to Calcutta. And we are terrified by homeless people on the streets, piles of trash and local prices. That is for free. If we convert it to rubles, nothing. We are running out of resources, but the borders are still closed. Are we gonna become Indian slaves, working day and night for a penny? Let's begin our journey. Oh my gosh, guys! We have woken up from these terrible sounds. What the heck is happening, Anton? What time is it? 7.40? What is happening, Anton? What the drums are these? Where are they? Holy moly, it's from the temple! Oh my gosh! It is too much, guys, that is impossible to sleep here. They awakened us. They are burning something here. Look there, they lit something. Seen that? Yeah, yeah. Can I just sleep, guys? I can't sleep in this hotel, I couldn't sleep in the train. Oh my gosh! Yes, I slept in the train. Should I cry at them? They play the drum, and then ring intensively, it goes endlessly. Well, Om told us that this happens every morning, cause they are not regular Hinduists. It is Bengal Hinduism. Anton wants to rent a bike. Om says it is a bad idea, cause the traffic will be insane. He is looking at the screen, look there! And now he's hiding it. An old man came to him. Wait, wait, he touched it. Touched his head. And placing the Hindu dot on his forehead. And gives him sugar. And that happens in a small house. It is located right in the yard. Guys, we have found a man who stole a cover in Chernobyl. This badass placed it here, on this sofa. Look at this sofa cover. Why did you steal our clothes? Thank you, thank you, thank you. And you place it here. I am very glad to, uh, to take a pic with your side. Do you get him? Yeah, sure, he said it wasn't him. And he didn't know anything. We have learned here that Calcutta, as we say, is a swear word here. We should say Calcutta. No, 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 Calcutta. Russian guys here in India. Guys, that's a hell. Bars on all windows here. The crime rate must be high here. Because every window has a bar. Even on the highest floors. I think they do it for a good reason. Look here, there's an old lady shaking the clothes over here. We don't have breakfast today. How is it possible? Because we pay for one day, not for two. I've got an idea. Let's have a meal of fruit only today. Okay, but we must clean them. I mean peel. They wash fruit in sewage. Bro, go banana, orange. Yes, yes, uh, fruit, yes, fruit, 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 okay? So yes, we actually made a mistake eating some beans in a in train with onion. Frankly speaking, our stomachs were a bit upset of it. Yeah, we have had an adventure. Well, now we would like some fruit, maybe some bananas. He says it is no good. Okay, let's go. Om said they are bad. Who knows? Maybe a bat chewed them, and there's coronavirus in them. A dog sleeping on the stall. Oh my gosh! We've got grand chances to get hit by a car. Traffic is just crazy here. A policeman came out, because kids are walking across the road. He has stopped everyone. Kids must be excited. That is the city's sewage. I hope we don't fall here. Because it is possible. Lots of open spots. These guys are doing something here. And there is an awesome view. You may never see it again, guys. Just look at it. Poops from the entire city are being flushed down. Yeah, they really pour sewage in the river, guys. The color is acid yellow. So dirty. After being food poisoned in the train, We've decided not to take risk anymore. And we're gonna find local KFC. Do you believe that there is a KFC, Anton? Sure, it is the former capital of India. How 20 million people fit in this city? 
Just look at all this. Oh my gosh, look at this cool shopping mall. Wow, the police guarding the entrance. We have found KFC. But first we need to get through the guards. A shopping center is guarded so heavily. Just imagine the crime rate in the city. This machine is cleaned very well. We drank from a dirty one. You're right, it is more neat here. And they have disposable cups, cool. Better than one glass for everyone. But he has a bike juice maker, manual labor. What? Closed? Really? Why? Oh no! I've tried it, Anton. If it's okay, take it. <laughs> Look what he's doing. Oh my, imagine if he cuts his finger. A half of it has gone. A drinking straw. Cool, come on, try it. Do you like it? Were there enough of bacteria? That is trash. Awful. I told you about it. We gotta find a McDonald's or we're gonna die here. He likes that. Look at him. Good? Good, good. How much it costs? It was about 30 rupees. For one nut. One for 30 rubles? Is it costy? When I was in Sochi, one coconut costed me 700 rubles. 700? Yes! <laughs> 10 rupees for 1 kilometer. Almost explaining where to go. This guy is wiping shit here, for real. It may touch us. Oh no, bacteria. Let's get out of here. Finally, we have made a deal. We're gonna get to subway station first, and then McDonald's. Are you happy? Yeah. I would like to ride an electric rickshaw. Tired of normal ones. Imagine that, I have seen a four-seat electric rickshaw once. Maybe it was a rare one. I like these cabs. From 60s, you know? It is authentic. Yeah. We are in the middle of nowhere now. So? There are even more people. There must be a blue metro line somewhere. So a rickshaw taxi ride costed us one buck for four people. Is it the subway? There may be some guards. I'm glad they don't check everyone. We need to buy a coin for a start, a small queue. You know, this place is nice, not dirty at all. I can bet that the Japanese built this. As always, Indians couldn't do it. Not working. The coins cost 10. We have got just 50 rubles. That is the coin. Indian Railways. That's it. Kolkata. There's a bridge on it. Is the local symbol? What the hell is that? There's the AC. Yeah, really. That's cool. It is freezing cold here. And we're getting cold. It is Murphy's Law, bro. And we have 30 minutes more to go. Really? We have found a McDonald's in the center of Calcutta. And I think our guys have never been there. Look at them, they're surprised. No people, no one here. Their McDonald's is very different, there's another menu. Prices are different. We have a richer menu, I can say. We have ordered many things for 600 rubles here. And we have managed to pay it with a Russian credit card. Yes, Alec just checked if we can do this. And it worked. First, there was an error on the screen, but then it worked. Sberbank works even in India. These guys are kinda sad because we have ordered some meat. They said, why do you kill animals? They suffer. No chicken, no, I'm vegan. <laughs> why don't they eat western food? What's the matter with them, guys? It is a regular McDonald's. We don't know yet. You're right, we must try it first. Yeah, we're gonna make a small review of an Indian McDonald's, guys. Is it barbecue sauce? Yeah, let's compare it with ours. Like at home. No sugar cola, said. An Indian burger. From McDonald's. I feel like they lack something. There is cheese, a big burger, firm. Let's try. Ours have a richer taste. 
The smell is different. It's uh, kind of tasteless or something. I've got some nuggets. Let's taste them with sauce. It is just the same, really. The European standards are everywhere after all, even in India. Mm -hmm. Good chicken. McDonald's, nice. Nice. Yeah. We have just found out that there is a ketchup for the burger. It's India, the land of spice. I gonna taste it. Opening. Pouring some. Now we are talking. Okay. Yeah. Something went wrong. Now I wanna taste it. This reaction has pros, the sugar you added mixed in. That is admiring to observe the reaction. Maybe it is the first time they are in the shopping mall. And they might be overwhelmed with excitement now. Om says go go. Is he nervous? He may feel awkward. Can you tell us, please, what engine you've got? Is it Volga? Yes, it's a Volga. Diesel? Wow, it isn't Volga. What is that? What model it is? What? Porsche? I didn't hear that well. A fan for passengers. It must be hot here. But do you feel okay for now, right? Well, our cabman went out to buy something. And finally he has bought a bag, oh my. He made it right on the going, on the street, on duty. He didn't care about our sitting. Like, guys, I just need a bag, can you sit here? And he went out and bought it. We are just in India. We've asked about the price, 300 rubles. That is not a village, it is something wilder. Look there, they forge over here, like in 17th century. They like digging trash, am I right, Anton? They recycle cardboard and sell it like new. There are bags made of whatever you want here, oh my gosh. Birds have shattered all over. They insulating their houses. You know this slum area is so big. I don't see the end of it. Look there. Yeah, oh my gosh. We have seen really poor people here in India. And they drag heavy carriages like slaves, just imagine it. I think the English taught them to do it. They couldn't make it up themselves. Oh my, we are in a dangerous district. Yesterday it was much calmer. It turned out that there are people who consider themselves slaves. They live like this and drag these carriages. They carry other people in these rickshaws. Who is more rich? I hope we're gonna survive this. Oh my gosh! That is something different from elephant riding. Everyone is looking at us again, yeah. He's dragging us to the poorest area. Oh my gosh, we're gonna be surrounded there. I feel like we are riding some animal, an elephant maybe, or a giraffe. Because it's shaking from side to side, not up and down. And it has a terrible backlash of wheels. And there's a thing, dude, there's no tire. There are just wooden wheels, which have a rubber cover. Someone is coming to us. Oh no, it's alright. Oh my gosh, look how people live there. Is he tired, guys? Some more? Alright. He's so strong. He may be doing it all his life. I still can't believe it's for real. Why people do it at all? There's a crowd behind us. There's a queue to make a selfie with us. <laughs> yes, go, go. Little speed. Little speed. So, guys, I think none of the Europeans have ever dragged a slave. No one of Slavs, at least. <laughs> I gotta be careful, it's an old man. 
The thing is, they learn from childhood. If they were born slaves, they will always be slaves. And we've decided to break this stereotype, make it all opposite, and show everyone that European can drag a slave on it. I feel like regular walking dude, that's not hard at all. These people are so astonished, that's it, they don't follow us. European drags a slave. <laughs> Look there. Locals don't get us. That's cool, guys. Are you tired? It's easy, man. Are you ready to run, Alex? Yeah, sure? Okay, I gotta go fast now. Om doesn't know yet. Come on, come on, go. He cries, slower, slower. Is it really so easy, Anton? It is easy, bro. A job for a lazy then. Go. Yes. Go. Go. Двоих? Yes. <laughs> Loaded. Oh my gosh. Put it to the belly. Yeah, I got it. Walking is so easy. Let's add some speed. I hope I can't stop. Oh my, it is so hard to stop it. That was cool. And now a selfie. Do you wanna try it? They can do it. Oh, really? They're from wrong cast. No, 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 no. Understand. Well, guys, we couldn't expect this gonna be funny. We are shocked, so to say. And the locals were amazed with that. They just have seen how white people are dragging a slave on his own rickshaw. So the myth is broken. It is not hard to carry people on rickshaws. There are a few drawbacks, but walking with it is easy. We are very confused because there are too much people here. People couldn't expect they're gonna see this, but uh, nevertheless, big thanks to this man, this cabman, the owner of the rickshaw, that he gave us a chance to experience this and try it ourselves. This manual labor. It is not really awful, though there are some difficulties, it is hard to handle. And sometimes the life conditions are extremely bad. And people have to work like slaves. The trouble is, they get used to this life. The government tries to change this and change the way of life of these people. They say go find better job and so on. Now we are at the Indian market in Calcutta. And we would like to show you the prices. There is a shop assistant. What is this thing? Grapefruit? 40 rubles for 1 kilogram of carrots. Bell pepper 50 rubles per kilogram. Beetroot 30 rubles for a kilo. Lime 10 rubles for a kilo. What are those small apples? These are dates. Oh no. I don't want this. That smells awful. It smells rotten. Like these apples were out of date for long, you know? A smell of waste. Friends, we want to know the prices of the most regular Slav products, which we are able to buy here. They are known in all over the world. Tomatoes and cucumbers. 40 rubles for a kilo. Can you believe this? 20 rubles for one kilo of tomatoes. Tomatoes are good quality here. There are plenty of people around us. They wonder what we are doing here. 40 rubles for these eggplants, that's almost free. If only we had the same prices in Russia, we would have full stomachs every day. We would never have homeless people. Wait, why is there so many poor people in India? That's a good question for me, I don't understand. This market is next to the road, and the dust covers all food here. It is all over here. Are these bananas radioactive here? Let us check them out. An awful lot of people are gathering here. They don't even understand what is happening here. 
They have never seen such thing in their lives. Are they radioactive? 15, 17. They are okay. A regular zucchini. Two durables per one. One cabbage costs 10 rupees. What the hell is that, guys? Looks like mice. One hundred rubles for one kilogram of apples. They're the most pricey in India. One hundred rubles and five rupees for one banana. So the bananas are the cheapest, Anton. That is what we're gonna buy. Next, we are going to show you how much costs Pepsi, chips, and all yummies that you eat in front of the screen. Let's go. Two rupees for one pack. It's almost free. It is zero point troubles if we can the price. Wow, classic. Shampoo for 140 rubles. We could watch the entire life here. 100 years anniversary of revolution soon. Do they celebrate it here in India? Hammer and sickle in India. Wow. Well, Soviet Union helped India some time ago. It says 5 rupees. 5 rubles for a pack of chips. 85 rubles for 2 liters of Pepsi. Well, also the water in India and so on are almost the same. Like in Ukraine or Russia. European standards are everywhere. What is that? I don't know. Japan M, Japan That is Viagra. <laughs> Guys, we've decided to visit the local hardware store and check the price of devices here. And I can say that prices are more the same. The hardware always costs the same even in India. When you're first time in an Indian city, you're gonna be shocked. People sleeping on the streets, crazy traffic, cars, bikes, bicycles, everyone's beeping. That is very noisy here, really, ears hurt. But then you get used to it, and maybe next day you'll be okay. About crime level, we haven't got any troubles here in Kolkata. No one even tried to steal our things here. There was the opposite thing. When our guys went out to have a meal, Om and his brother. Om forgot his bag with a t-shirt, which he just bought. And then the lad that works here ran out and has given back the bag to our guys. That is it. No trouble. He could steal this bag. Yeah. It's not that scary here after all. But first day, yes. Because we were going at night through a very bad street. Guys, we're just getting started comparing to what is coming soon here. Let's go.